people! This is Fisher12, and we have another exciting episode of the Black Ops Show for you guys today, as always. And the other day, Activision reported on this bizarre news story. They reported on their blog, and the headline reads, Korean pop group Agio Generation opens tour to sell out crowd. And the article talks about this K-pop group starting their three-year tour with a sold-out show in South Korea, I'll just read the first paragraph for you guys. Korean pop group Ayego Generation kicked off their world tour in Seoul, South Korea last night to a crowd of over 400,000 fans. This first show kicks off their four-leg Daebak Stadium tour consisting of over 210 shows boasting the world's first neo-animatronic zoo complete with an 80-foot robotic crystal giraffe. Now, if you Google this Korean pop group, you won't get any results back, alluding to the fact that this article isn't real. But if you needed further evidence, the article also uses lines like, their hit song, which has topped the non-AI charts for 14 weeks straight. So, this begs the question, why would Activision and Treyarch post about it? Either it's giving some intel, or Vaughn finally got that DJ gig he's been trying for, but I have a feeling it's the first one. Now, the article finishes with an important line that I believe to be our intel. One setback for the group and their tour, continued instability in and around the Mediterranean Sea has led to postponed tour dates in Malta, Cyprus, and Corfu. So I think this is alluding to campaign because what could possibly be causing instability in the Mediterranean Sea? My guess is some catastrophic event caused by a blackout in U.S. military operations, which we know to be a huge component of the campaign storyline. And consequently, I think it might also be possible that this is some multiplayer intel as well, since we know many multiplayer maps are based off single-player levels. But I'm curious to hear what you guys think of this fake news article. Do you think it's related to campaign? If so, how? Let me know in the comments down below. Do you guys really want to see that 80-foot robotic crystal giraffe? Because I do. And if you do too, you can show it by leaving a like on this video and subscribing to the channel if you're new here. But other than that, guys, hope you enjoy the video. And take care.